Currents moving surface water offshore act like a conveyor belt. They draw cold water from the depths and along with it, natural material that for years has drifted like snow into the abyss. At the head of narrow canyons, behind sea mounts and the steepest parts of the continental shelf, these nutrients re-emerge to fuel the pelagic food chain. Seabirds and marine mammals, like the wandering albatross from New Zealand and rare pygmy killer whale, gather to exploit prey normally scattered over the ocean, but now concentrated here. Animals more usually found in barren tropical waters head south as this vast stream acts like a giant sweep, leaving little in its wake. One of the largest predators on Earth, the mighty sperm whale, congregate at the edge of the most active systems. Off the sapphire coast, along the rim of the continental shelf, occasionally huge nursery pods are recorded close to shore. The abrupt seasonal acceleration of activity provides resources for animals and humans alike. 20 million short-tailed shearwaters arrive from Japan and Russia to breed, feeding on accumulating small fish and krill. Humpback whale cows and calves, starved for several months in barren tropical waters to the north, get their first chance to feed here during their long migration back to krill-rich Antarctic waters.